welcome back to Busy's Toy World. And today, you guys might remember this little cutie here. Um, she actually is super duper sick. Um, so she is super sick. So I'm gonna show you uh, guys what I'm gonna do for her to make her better. Yesterday we were out late in the cold and stuff, so she has a cold and I don't know what else she might have. So let's get started. So I'll show you what I have. Oh, come here, my baby. Okay, to start off with what we have is I'm gonna start by making her bed. What I'm gonna do is this is her little mat. So we're gonna put her on here with her little pillow. She has a boppy, which we call cupcake, but we don't have it right now, it's in the wash. And then this is her favorite stuffy. She uses it as a blanket, but mostly as a stuffy. And then this blanket right here, she uses all the time. And um, but we're gonna get her nice and ready. So I'm gonna move it over here so you guys can so I can show you what I got. Okay. So what I have to make her better is many different things. Um, I have this for her. I'll show you why in a minute. But all I can say right now is it's from this little monster, Mia. Um, so we got this. This is one of our first aid kits. Um, which is like our tape and stuff. This is her toy. Um, this is our first aid kit for newborns. So I'll show you what's inside in a minute. And then her food. Um, she has some noodles, chicken noodle soup. Um, well, we don't eat, chi we, she doesn't eat chicken noodle soup actually. So in this, we have some noodles right here, chicken broth, or some sort of broth. Um, I learned this off a recipe. Egg right here. And right here is some lettuce. And then in here, we got crackers. She absolutely love cra loves crackers. We've got some french fries. Again, she loves french fries, and there's some salt and pepper on the on everything in here. Have some a little piece of bread, which is super soft. And then she has some chips, which um, um don't worry, these are actually from a baby store, so they are, as you guys can tell, they are super breakable. So you gotta be careful with those. You don't want them to break. So everything is super, super, super soft. So as you can see, like thighs are squishy. Yeah. Throw that one away. Psh. Psh. Okay. And then, these are just regular baby crackers. And then if she wants anything else, I will just get that for her. And so, yeah, let's get started. And we'll use a hot rag and stuff if she needs it. Okay. So, what we're going to start by doing is I'm going to start by first moving the camera. Okay. Hi, baby. So, she had a little nap. And right here, there's a cut right there, so I'm going to seal that up. And then um, she has a little cut on her leg right here. Um, but I think that should be fine. We just really need to worry about that because Mia did that She was because she was not having a very good day. So we're going to start by um, showing you guys what's in 
fit here. What's in this little box? So in this box, um, we have some little cushions. Um, Mar this is just that. And some tape. Um, and um, scent. So this is gauze. We don't really, we need a small gauze pack, which is this. And we're just going to cut off a little bit right here. Put that right here and then put a little piece of tape on it. Um, and I'm right here, guys. So I'm going to go get a piece. I mean, some scissors, which I have right next to me. Ow. Don't worry, guys. I didn't hurt myself with the scissors. I tripped because they're on the bed. And let me just grab them right about now. So let me get up and grab them. Hey guys, and I have adult supervision and using some scissors. So we're just gonna cut right here. And I don't want anyone saying that is a waste of materials. Because it is not a waste of materials. My baby is um, very sick. So, yeah. And I have no idea what this piece is for. And then we're going to switch over here. And put it. Don't worry guys, I have cleaned it already. And then we're gonna take some gauze, um, some of this tape. And as guys, no need to worry. Um, I actually have done this before. And she was all better after at least a day. And then, so I just take this off after a little bit just to keep it sealed in for a minute. Um, and guys, she's fine. She may not look the best right now, but she's fine. And then I'm gonna show you guys what is in here. Um, I'm trying not to open it upside down. Okay, so this is what's in here. So we have a thermometer, some cream, which I put um onto the bandage. I don't know if you guys saw that. But I did, and we have some shot right here. Um, some little scissors I use personally to get those out for the middle at least. Um, don't you guys, that was my foot. A little Q-tip, which it is fuzzy, if you like. Well, obviously it is. 
Um, some pills. Ointment. Wait, man. And some vitamins. And we have other things, but that's just what's in the main one. So why did I close that? I'm going to do that. Oh, and thermometer. So we're going to start off by taking her temperature. So we do it this many different places, but first what we're going to do is we're going to do it right here, um, right here under her bracelet. Beep. Okay, that's normal right there. Alright, so the main, we, then we do it on the sides. If we get no response, that's fine. Means we just got to clean it off. And then we go for the top of the head right about here. Okay. Oh my gosh. It's 105. Maybe let me try that again. Beep, 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 beep. Still the same. Okay. Um, that's not good. So. What we're gonna do is we're gonna get um, a rag. Right here, and um, we're gonna wait for this to set a little bit. Take that off so we can do this, and then we'll put that back on later. One hour later. So now it's been one hour, so we can take this off. Let's check it out. And that little piece on there will get off. Hang on, let me take it off. 